autumn, the season of color, nature begins to shift from almost unicolored green into hundreds of different shades of red, yellow and orange. As the temperature drops, the air feels fresher in our lungs. It truly is a season of change. And as the leaves fall, we get reminded of the circle of life. It's a wonderful time, and I guess that for most landscape photographers, it is the busiest time of the year. We all have been longing to take our cameras and go out and try and capture the beauty of autumn. And if you are lucky, we get to witness scenes like this. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's so very nice to see you again. Today it's the 9th of October and it's a really beautiful day today. Got clear blue skies, almost no wind and perfect temperature. So it's going to be a really nice day in the outdoors. And uh, today I'm just, yeah, I'm just out and see what I can see. I have no real plan. To start with I'm just going to follow this dirt road and yeah, it's some kind of agriculture farming area, so yeah, I'm just gonna see what I can see. There are some cows here and some migratory birds out on the field. So yeah, it's looking to be a really nice day. Can you hear that? There's a woodpecker in this tree here, and uh, I think I can get some really nice footage of it. Ah, this is what I love about days like this. I can take it so easy and take my time and I can stand here and just listen and watch this woodpecker. <laughs> it's so fantastic. And uh, I want to take this opportunity to thank you all for 
tuning into my channel and liking and subscribing and writing comments. I'm really, really grateful for all the support that you guys are, are giving me. Ah, this little woodpecker is so nice. It's so lovely out here today, but there isn't much going on in terms of landscape photography. And I kind of knew that when I went out this morning, because yeah, the sky is clear blue and that's not really optimal for landscape photography. The light is too harsh, but it's nice to be out and not feel any pressure of capturing specific shots. So I've had a really nice time along this road. But I do have some plans for landscape photography day, today. And I'm just gonna go back to my car and back home and have some lunch and wait until the sun gets lower in the sky so I get better light. So I have a, a location in mind and there's a really lovely stream through an area with lots of leafy trees. So hopefully there's a lot of autumn colors left there. And so I see you a little bit later in this afternoon. Wow, this is a really nice location. So beautiful here. And we've got several streams here and some small waterfalls. And the trees has lost maybe 50% of their leaves. So the ground is covered in yellow and orange leaves. Really beautiful here. So I think it's time to get my Nikon Z7 out of the bag and see if I can get a nice shot there. Okay, so I got my Nikon Z7 with a 24 to 70 zoom lens and I think this shot right here is going to be at 24 millimeters. And there's quite a lot of reflections, bright reflections in the water. And to get rid of those, I'm also going to use a polarizing filter. So yeah, now just a matter of finding a nice composition. Okay, so this is the composition that I have. I'm quite happy with it. It's a really lovely scene. And I got my polarizing filter on. You see right now the glare is pretty high in the water there. But as I turn the polarizing filter it gets darker. And that's what I want. 
And also I've angled the camera down because if I have it up like this, the, the bright spots from the sky shows and I don't want that. So I've angled the camera down to eliminate that. And I'm at f11 because I want the, the image to be sharp from foreground and all the way to the waterfall. And I'm at ISO 64 to get the clearest and be best picture quality as possible. And 1.3 seconds. So, and I got my focus point here in the foreground. Okay, so I'm ready to take the shot. Two second self timer. There we go. Yeah, looking good. Okay, so this is gonna be the last photograph in this video. And I'm at 70 millimeters and I'm just pointing the camera straight down. I wanted to capture this beautiful footpath with all the leaves. And I don't care so much about the composition. I just wanna capture the chaos with all the textures and different colors. So yeah, this is the end of the video. If you like the content, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, I'm very happy if you could subscribe so I'm very happy for all the support I can get for my channel okay I see you in the next video bye for now